When I think of Thanksgiving, what comes to mind is not thankfulness or a big turkey. What I think of is far more important and serious. Every year at the end of November, families all across the United States celebrate the Thanksgiving holiday. This occasion has evolved into a time of expressing gratitude and sharing a bountiful meal with family. Relatives have awkward conversations while a huge turkey is scarfed down around a table. When I was in grade school, my history books depicted the first Thanksgiving meal as a peaceful gathering between white European settlers and Native American people. But there is a lesser known truth behind this narrative. This Thanksgiving origin story that I was taught in school was a revisionist and whitewashed version of what actually happened. Following the arrival of Christopher Columbus on the shores of America in 1492, a steady stream of white European families traveled across the Atlantic Ocean to settle in this new territory. At first, they were ill-equipped to handle the harsh realities of its wilderness and climate. But indigenous tribes fed them and taught them how to grow corn and other crops to live on the land. Then, everything took a turn for the worse. This is where the revisionist whitewashing in this story happens, because it was not a peaceful coexistence between Native American tribes and white colonial settlers. Empowered by their religious beliefs and a racist disdain for the indigenous tribes, white European settlers murdered and stole from the indigenous communities who had been thriving on this land for thousands of years and multiple generations. These colonial settlers destroyed indigenous cultures by eradicating them, and even sold captive tribal members off to slavery. This brutal and racist genocide continued throughout the expansion of the United States westward to the Pacific Ocean. Five-term governor of Plymouth Colony, William Bradford, described Native Americans as savage people who are cruel, barbarous, and most treacherous. At every level, the settlers were intent on vilifying and disempowering indigenous people. Thanksgiving has been whitewashed as a symbol of kind gratitude expressed by the white European settlers toward native tribes. This revisionist history only serves to silence the stories and voices of the millions of indigenous people who were slaughtered under a heartless and cruel colonialist agenda. Since 1970, the United American Indians of New England have carried out a national day of mourning during the U.S. Thanksgiving holiday. This is what they have to say about it. Thanksgiving Day is a reminder of the genocide of millions of Native people, the theft of Native lands, and the relentless assaults on Native culture. Participants in National Day of Mourning honor Native ancestors and the struggles of Native peoples to survive today. It is a day of remembrance and spiritual connection, as well as a protest of the racism and oppression which Native Americans continue to experience. As you enjoy your turkey over Thanksgiving, you have the power to acknowledge the impossibly sad and deeper truth behind the occasion. Talk about it and share this truth, or perhaps do not even celebrate the holiday at all. People often say that ignorance is bliss. I would take this a step further and say that ignorance is a complete lack of compassion. We need more compassion in the world. Compassion toward the indigenous survivors who continue to face this oppression. Within our hearts and minds, we need compassion that honors the lives and dignity of the millions of murdered indigenous people of America. <laughs>